Welcome back folks to Let's Play The Unholy War for the Sony PlayStation. I'm Samurai TX. The last time we left off we did win Scenario 5 which was held in the river crossing. It was very difficult but we somehow managed to pull through. So far so good for this blind Let's Play. I wonder what's next for us since um, it's getting harder and harder. But there's nothing that can take us down and I'm willing to accept this challenge and see this through. I think there's 13 missions in this game. I'm not too sure. There's 13 maps anyway I'm, I'm from checking off screen. So I'm pretty sure that there's only 13 missions. There might be more. But I'm not going to get ahead of myself right now. I just want to continue enjoying this campaign mode. So let's get going. And we're going to end up reading more. Alrighty. Each Technos culture is a separate nation with its own unique laws and customs. The most independent of all are the violent cyborg kill cycles. Each of these foul smelling hybrid patrols his own feudal domain. Often just a parcel of wasteland inhabited by the by primitive tribesmen and the rare migratory Brontu herd. Let's continue. Where are we going? We are going to the Twin Keeps. Right. I'm so excited to keep playing this game blind. It's so awesome. Scenario 6, Twin Keeps. Our expansion through this region is nearly complete. We have techno-formed all of the surrounding lands and now only a single poorly guarded Arkine base remains. However, if Arkine reinforcements are allowed to fortify their positions, our battle may be a long one. Finish the job with expediency. Normal AI Arkine goes first. It's clobbery time! Alrighty, let's get going. Fear right now, let's see. Looks like we're gonna buy a kill cycle, definitely. I'm gonna want a kill cycle for sure. And let me make. Um, Alright, let's move Razor Fame forward. Let's buy a kill cycle. There he is. Buy him. Play him there. But now we're going to move him to the resource point. So let's get some money very early on. And let's move um, Corlex forward. Now it's their turn. Well, it's a good move what I did there. And there's more money points, but it's more nearer to their base than mine. I only got one money base. So we're going to have to make it count, you know? Okay, my turn. We got another AT AUR. We will buy another kill cycle. Place kill cycle. Oops, place kill cycle here. We're going to move him forward there. We're going to move Quirlex forward. And we're going to move Razor Fane a bit closer. So let's go. Your turn. Brontu looks like he's going to um, withdraw. What did I tell you? What about Fira? Fira looks like she's gonna... Wow, they're withdrawing. Well, okay. You can do that. I don't mind. Um, well... We're gonna move Razor Fane on here to gain some um, currency. We're gonna move Kill Cycle this way. And we are going to move the Scorpion behind Razor Fane. And end our turn. But they're probably gonna recruit a Piranha next. To recruit more people. But without further ado, we're gonna fight Fira. The female human torch. Kill Cycle should have this because all he needs to do is just be on top of her and do the hidden missile. Alright, let's fly on top. Alright, we got this. Hidden missile! And we got her. Nice. And let's land on the ground and celebrate. Yeah, baby, yeah. Nice work, Bane. You definitely are an ass kicking machine. Right, next. Their turn. Bolgani, are you going to move forward? Nope, you're withdrawing. Well, okay. I told you they were going to recruit a piranha. I just called it. And spawning fails. That's disappointing, isn't it? Alrighty, let's... Let's move Kill Cycle close to base. And let him fight Geek. Haha, <laughs> let's, waste, let's waste away your piranhas. Alright, we're going to take the air. Oh, this level. Really? 
hidden missiles! Oh, we hit him once, that's pretty cool. Or hit her once, since it's the one that lays the babies. Right, they're gonna try and outsmart me by jumping right here. Nope, you're not sh you're not biting on me. Get lost. Super jump. Okay, you can super jump. I'm not going to be near you anytime soon. I just want to charge my meter. And now I want to get away from you. Because you have super jump. Now we're going to um, charge our meter. Health. Let's get the health. Oh, it looks like they got it. No, they didn't. Alright, I'm going to collect the health instead then. Which is pretty nice. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. And we're going to... Keep shooting piranha. Ha ha! Alright, there we go. So far so good. Oh my goodness. Let's recoup our energy. Recoup, recoup, recoup. Not recoup our energy. Recoup our meter, sorry. Um, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. One more hit. One more hit. Health, health, health. Let's get it. See what to deal with a shot. Yes! Ha ha! Well done, babe. That was awesome work. Very awesome work. Is he going to bring out Bronto or is he going to retreat? He's retreating. Okay, that's very good. We've got him retreating. Oh, it's my turn, that's why. Well, obviously, but normally they can fight back. But already, well, they did chose not to. Pretty weird that they chose not to fight. Right, let's move Razor Fane forward. It's time to attack. Is Bronto going to fight or run away? He's running away! Okay, you can run away. Oh, okay. Well, looks like we're going to... Uh, we're going to move Razor Fane. Are we, can we fight Brontu? No, but Razor Fane can fight Erica. Let's go. She's a ground person, so we're going to take that advantage while we can. Oh, it's this level. Yeah, you jump away. Yeah, you can't hide forever, you know. Yeah, I got you once. I got more of the health advantage, but your projectile does more damage, I think. Or does mine? I think mine does, actually. Alright, ouch, ouch. She does 7 damage and I do 10, so... She knows mine does more damage. But she's got the super jump ability, so she has more of an advantage of jumping now. But I don't really need to jump as much, I just need to run and keep my distance. Her projectile has a better reach than mine as well, so... I'm at a disadvantage a bit, but I'm going to make it count. And looks like I press triangle to do the saw blades and I win. And Razor Fane laughs his head off because he knows that we are close to victory. This has been longer than expected, but looks like we're going to seal the deal very quickly. Oh, we got enough, we got enough resources to buy someone else. Okay. Let's buy Quicksilver. Just in case. Who can move more? I'm going to make a move forward. Is this my last turn? No, one more turn. Okay, let's move forward. Brontu is pretty much screwed at this point. And so is the, um, oh no, the base. That's why Brontu is risking it coming forward. Brontu has an advantage because Brontu has like two times more health than me. So I'm pretty much screwed. But we're going to make it count. Wow, we are going to make it count because Brontu really just stood, oh, really just stood there. And let us attack him four times. Don't know why he would allow that, but he condoned it. Right, can we attack from here? Yes, we can. We're going to collect the super jump. Bronto is pretty being reckless here. But Razor Fade's not having none of it. <laughs> Look at that. That's very easy. Come on. One more hit. Bronto is pretty much gone risky, um, risk tac risky tactics, and it didn't pay off as much. We did lose um, 24 health in the process, but Razor Fane decided to just shoot the hell out of him for the fun of it. Razor Fane's really power powerful. He really is. Got to give him credit where it's due. Right, we're gonna attack the main person, Josrai. We have a lot of people to attack, so we're gonna move forward again. Quicksilver, move forward, and we're gonna wait. We're gonna wait for another um, turn. So, all right, let's move um, Razor Fane again. Never mind, we can't move Razor Fane. We're gonna. Um, can we move the kill cycle? Yes, we can. 
We're just going to attack, actually. Quicksilver will come here another time. But yeah, we're going to attack him. He's pretty much screwed, because I could just attack him with um, more people, actually. So, if Bane dies, I've got Razor Fane. If Razor Fane dies, i got the... Um, I got the um, Scorpion or the Mantis, but I'm planning on winning with Bane. You know, I don't want to lose immediately. Ah, Energize! All right, we're in the ascendancy here with the attack. We can we can fly with him. All right, let's go. Come on, we can do this. Oh God, we're on twelve, but we've hit him twice, which is good. It's an okay start, I suppose. Right, we gotta, we gotta, um, we gotta stay away from him for now and regain. Uh, um, should just get the re-energized. There we go. Is there another thing here? It's health. All right, let's get the health. Oh, he got us. Son of a goat. Victory. There it is. All right, Spears, you're up. All right, let's get that health because you're dying, Razor Fit. Never mind. It trolled us. Well, Razor Fane looks like he's going to die too, actually. Well, we're going to stay here for now and play the keep away game. Let's, tell, let's just keep going in the teleporter. Well, he's probably going to get the energized. Yeah, I've lost. Oh, that was stupid strategy right there. Yeah, you can celebrate your victory. We've lost two people trying to um, be risky. It's failing at the moment. Okay, it's his turn again. Looks like we only have 60. Let's put people on there and try and recruit a Jaeger. You know, the one with the missiles. The robot with the missiles. Let's move Quicksilver this way. And, um... Let's just move you... Well, we can't afford another person, so let's... Oops, don't press circle. Triangle. Player. Move. Move you that way. Your turn. Oh, they've recruited someone. Okay, 110. Right, let's move someone on here. We're going to move Kill Cycle off the um, money zone because of the fact that we're going to um, get Jaeger next turn anyway. They skipped their turn, so it looks like we're going to recruit a Jaeger. Let's move the robot this way. Actually, you know what? Can you teleport someone? You can, right? Player. Teleports. But you can only teleport yourself. I thought you could teleport the ally. I actually thought you can teleport the ally, which would have been a better concept, but obviously you can't. Let's move forward. Our turn again, okay. We're just going to move Jaeger closer. Move Kill Cycle closer. And move Quicksilver closer. Let's fight Kree. Yeah, I know I made this longer than expected, but I should have really recruited that big robot machine first. What's we'll serve Quicksilver's attacks? Okay, her attacks just basic. Oh, get off! Oh! Oh, Quicksilver's dead, man. Maybe recruit Quicksilver was a terrible idea. I'm not recruiting Quicksilver again. I just wanted to try her, but I don't pers personally. I don't like her. All right, that was a failed attack. A very failed attack. Are they going to spawn? No, nope, it failed. But they're going to battle Quirlex next. Hopefully, the Scorpion or Mantis can um, kill. Um, can kill the piranha. Stop killing my babies. Oh, what the hell? You somehow come, came on me? Get off! Alright, we win that battle. My god, that was weird. He somehow ended up being behind me and attacked me. God, alright, um, one, one more turn it looks like. Jaeger looks like he has to go close, so does Kill Cycle. We're gonna block him from spawning. We're gonna block him from spawning people, to be honest. Might as well do that. Right, who else do I have? Nope. 
Oh, I only got you, so we can only move you. Let's move you, not attack. Cancel. Okay, let's move you forward. Move you forward. I know Kill Cycle can attack, but we're not going to attack, okay? And let's move you that way again. Um, right, our turn. Jaeger! Go, 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 go! Yeah, I had to take my time to make Jaeger attack. I'm gonna do the hidden missiles! Must eliminate flying wingman. Must neutralize enemy. Missile attack. Missile attack. Charging meter. Shooting missiles again. Hidden missiles! And we win by doing the hidden missile attack. That was the only way we could win, to be honest, by using the robot. Because the robot's missiles are completely um, good, reaching air opponents. It follows them for a while. And we win! So that's a very good victory. Lost three people, but I'm not complaining. We killed six, and we got a dignified victory. So, clobbering time was complete. We did lose three more people. Get a bit more sloppy, but it's going to happen in a blind let's play, because I really don't know how to tactically be... Well, I do know how to be tactically astute, but, you know, I was a bit reckless in spending on and recruiting. I bought Quicksilver, and look what happened to Quicksilver after one fight. Quicksilver died. So, I really need to be more smart when I'm buying people. I'll basically spend money more on a Jaeger, which is the robot, um, Kill Cycle, Razor Fane, and probably Wasps here and there, but those are my three go-to people, um, Jaeger, Kill Cycle, and Razor Fane, because I'm actually good with those three. Unfortunately, Razor Fane died because he had no health, but Razor Fane was pretty damn good during the battle, so kudos to him. Alright, enough rambling. When we come back, folks, we will start Mission 7 again. Well, Mission 7. I can't say Mission 7 again, because we've never done Mission 7 before. This was Mission 6, but we'll start doing Mission 7. Until then. Until then. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Oh, before I go, can I just say this music's pretty damn awesome? <laughs> I just love this music. Even when you're in the menu, even when you're in the strategy mode moving, it's pretty damn awesome. Anyway, see you guys later.